Hello and welcome. Today we are going to unbox LC Power LC CC94 CPU cooler. So this is a budget uh, CPU cooler, and this cooler is a replacement for a box cooler. Uh, it's really inexpensive, so the price in Europe, I think, in retail shops, would be somewhere around eight euros maximum nine, or for example, in US would be probably around ten or even less than ten dollars. So this is a budget-friendly cooler, and uh, it's not intended for overclocking or using, I don't know, i9 Intel CPU with it, but 80 watts TDP, it can cover most of the Intel i5s or uh, AMD Ryzen 5s or even Intel uh, i7 CPUs uh, if you use it only as an office computer. Uh, what we have here as advertised is 80 watts TDP, uh, it can support, uh, that's something that I've seen through use. Uh, Multi-compatible, that's true, as it supports all of the Intel sockets except the 1700 LGA. And it supports all the current and existing AMD sockets. Uh, the last thing advertised here, silent fan, it is really silent. I've installed a dozen of these and they are silent, you don't hear them usually. And that's why they are very good replacement for box coolers, which usually aren't that silent, or if your box cooler stops malfunctioning, this is an uh, inexpensive replacement for it. Or if you're building an office uh, desktop PC and you don't need any expensive cooler, uh, but you buy, for example, CPU, which is a tray version, it's not boxed, you need a box cooler, this is again an excellent solution. Okay, so let's see what's in the box. There is the instruction manual. We can see here that uh, mounting of the CPU is done with this plastic bracket. There are plastic push pins that we use to fasten it. And this is good because practically on all of the sockets, uh, the installation procedure is the same. Uh, this page is in English, this one is in German. Uh, so that's it. And let's see the cooler itself. It's a very nice design. It has a good mass and weight, especially for a box cooler. Uh, the thermal paste is uh, pre-applied. There is a plastic cover here protect, protect, protecting the thermal paste. And we have this push pin. We first fasten this side onto the plastic bracket, and then we push and fasten the other, and then the cooler stands firmly. Uh, there is a four pin, so uh, the main board can regulate the, how fast the fan spins. And uh, by this design also, uh, LC managed to increase uh, the useful surface of this aluminum uh, cooling body, and then that heat dissipates better if it had like boxed traditional design. Okay, let's go on to the bracket. These are the plastic push pins, and here is the bracket. So if we look carefully here, this is not uh, a correct circle. This is more like a ellipsoid, ellipsoid. So by this shape, there is a little space to wiggle. And this is how uh, practically this bracket fits on all of the sockets. Yeah, so a couple of millimeters of moving this makes it, makes it fit on all the CPU sockets except the 1700 and also there are different angles how we can put the cooler here like this like this or like this again depending on the socket you're using so anyway uh, I will also show you uh, practical how to install it on a main board on a CPU and stay tuned for that part okay thank you and let's continue